you guys all have so many kids on set. I kind of imagine that you would have like a daycare there because your kids came to set. Did yours? Yeah. I mean, like, Zoe's got kids. Like Sienna. But then there's always something inappropriate or there's yeah. guns going off and the kids get freaked out and they, the kids come for a little bit and go, I hey, look, yes, there's the camera. Here's mom and dad. Now it's time to go home. Yeah. yeah. Because otherwise they get traumatized too much for them yeah yeah that was what my kids were there that when we were shooting off all those fireworks when we were driving through oh yeah University. what did they think of that they were they loved it they loved it and then after a while they were you know kind of freaked out it was loud right. people were screaming around dancing in the streets yeah, yeah. so yeah the prohibition it's hard to explain to them like this yeah. is pretend yeah they don't quite get it. it doesn't seem that pretend i had my son came on the set of the accountant and it was a scene where i had gotten thrown through a pane of glass and all the, the effects guys had laid out, it was after that moment, so they laid out all this, what looks like broken glass, they just used little rubber fragments. Mm -hmm. And he just couldn't, he was like, is this glass, is this real glass? This is pretend glass, and he got thrown through the pretend Like, it just was too much for his brain. Yeah. He couldn't quite, you know, they, it takes it, it, it takes a little while for them to get mature enough. And then by the time they're mature enough, they could they care less, they don't yeah. and they're not cool, yeah. and they just like, yeah. want to hang out with someone else. Obviously, you've gone through your ups and your downs, what helps you get through that, and what motivates you to change and, and to get through that? The same things that motivate me have always motivated me. It's just that I, I take my career really seriously. I work really hard. It matters a lot to me. Um, you know, you work just as hard on movies that work as movies that don't. You know, there's something about the sort of movie gods that just decide whether or not you get lucky. Mm -hmm. And then later in my life, you know, having family, that sort of superseded that, and that became the most important thing and put work in perspective. I had a fun moment with Sienna because I said to her, I go, how is it when you have to be directed by the actor you're having a love scene with, right? And she was telling you about the continuous <laughs> takes that you were making her do. Yeah, we were, the yeah. camera was pushing in and pushing yeah, back. Yeah, we were yeah, starting yeah. over like yeah. all scenes, you know, you, yes. you start the scene, you <laughs> yeah. get to the end, you go back to the beginning. It's but, fun not to cut sometimes right, and get so reset. Stay into yeah. it. But Sienna thought that I was trying to make myself out to be some kind of like... <laughs> world champion where it just never ended i just keep going going and then going again and again and just keep and so she started laughing and i was like this isn't laughing isn't really the response that i'm looking yeah. for for this you don't really want to get laughed at but it, but she was like but how many how long can you go how many you're you're superman the camera's still rolling so i wanted to just keep yeah going. But you didn't tell her that ahead of time. I didn't tell her that ahead of time. So <laughs> you just like sprung that on her. Yeah. I thought she would just roll with it. Yeah.